I get another spell. I get multiple spells. Oh my god. Oh. Oh shit. I have to increase my minions. Oh, I get three <laughs> hand trips because I took Tom. Oh, use better minions. Oh, uh, yeah, more, but I can just increase their health and our AC. No, no, not not more, just better. <laughs> yeah, I can just just, uh, just increase their AC and uh, have the same amount of minions. Well, I, am, and I don't increase have their Fireball AC. or anything. I'm Illusion. Yeah, wow. <laughs> I'm an Illusionist. You just crank the CR rating. That's what CR ratings are for. How do I only have two cantrips? I feel like every other character I have four. I drew it. Uh, Should have three. Yeah, most... I have many because I took Tome and I'm a warlock. But uh, when me. it comes to Druid, it depends on the race, I guess. Some races well, I, give I, I you two extra... right now. I should have three. Are you a high elf? If... No. If you're a high elf. High... You're a wood elf. I'm a wood elf. Oh, I think you still get one. I still, I should still have three. Yeah, and if I, I believe was a... elves gives um, some elf gives you high elves uh, too. Yeah, high elves give the... you an extra. I should have three spell slots and not just and, uh, not spell slots. Excuse me, cantrips to begin with. I shouldn't. I every other character I've had, I had three, but I have two for some reason right now. I uh, you just have to add useless. one. Yeah, I'm, it's, I'm going to do that. I'm just looking. Okay, so I'm gonna do a little quick recap. Uh, let's see, Athena's gonna be a little late. Mm -hmm. uh, but last time you guys went on a bunch of quests uh, for your factions. Some of you were just tied along and helped out. Uh, a little bit. You also did some more repairs, and you also uh, did something I did not expect you to do. You recruited a group of thugs for for to your workforce. <laughs> <laughs> that was just very unpredictable. Yes, I see no way in which that can come back to bite us. <laughs> as not long with the as specter here. Paid. Well, you do have like a uh, specter that can haunt them if they if they uh, do anything they're not supposed to do. So that's good. You have like a extra bodyguard or extra uh, a ghost that. Or you guards. could just lock me in there with them. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I believe they could defend themselves if they want to. I can turn into a dire wolf. They won't stand a chance. <laughs> Wanna bet? <laughs> Not really. <laughs> <laughs> you you can you can actually you guys can do some bidding and see how long he survives until he gets unconscious. <laughs> can I have like a brawl? In the basement. Get, get uh, take a free sip of ale. Get murdered by the specter. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. Maybe. Well, uh, no, uh, nothing special happened. You guys went uh, around and around the city doing quests for different factions, and you guys hopped out and. You killed a bunch of crows on the outskirts of uh, Waterdeep, and that's where you leveled up to level 3. And uh, Diella didn't want to do uh, the quest for the Harpers, but uh, I recall that uh, I forgot that you, Natalie, have already done your second level quest for the Harpers. You got the ticket to the opera. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and there you got your quest to talk to a horse. Mm -hmm. Fine, and talk to a horse. 
So technically, <laughs> she uh, should have a renown on her sheet when she gets here. Otherwise, uh, nothing special happens. So uh, you guys went back after fighting the crows, uh, scarecrows. Uh, you head back to the tavern to rest up. So, uh, is there anything special you want to do this day, uh, uh, this early day, early morning? I'm gonna check on that to see if that violent diarrhea clear. <laughs> <laughs> the violent what? The violent the diarrhea. Violent, was it? The violent diarrhea. That's uh, why she couldn't yeah. hang out with us. You know, uh, th that's why. That's oh, why yeah. you don't eat food from the street vendors. <laughs> <laughs> you don't, and you don't still, buy, you, do. you don't buy them. You don't buy them uh, street vendor hot dogs. Yeah, uh, but you because still do that. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you should give sausage, uh, the street vendors uh, some labels, to, uh, warning labels. Don't eat here. If, if eat here and you will get sick. Or something like that. Those exist by default. What you do is you go around <laughs> the corner from them and you see where the vomit piles are. <laughs> Yeah, you maybe could try. Yeah, you you could vomit track files. the vomit for, from its source. Uh, to its source. Unless, unless there's multiple food carts there. Oh. Well, true. then you might just want to avoid that district in general. Yeah. Or the that entire street. But I have. If you're hungry, don't go health. here. <gasps> Also, I forgot, Gail, you got inspiration last uh, session too. Yep. For recruiting for uh, the thugs, sparing their lives. I miss Rylan. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you. If Ash allows you, maybe you can level him down a little bit and he allows you to play him in his <laughs> campaign. In his... That wouldn't be good for anybody. <laughs> Not in this city. Well, that depends on what level, because uh, I don't think it will be... Uh, uh, level, uh, so there's going to be three of us, I think, playing on next week. Is that correct? Yes. Yes. All right, then I would say level four. I haven't decided what kind of character I want to make. I'd bring at least one person with healing spells. Yeah, who needs healing spells? Uh, nah. <laughs> Do I have any of those things? You guys have any if, if, if we all play barbarians, we can all just rage. You tank it. Face tank. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Take half damage all the time. <laughs> Very totem. <laughs> That will do the trick. Let's you can certainly try. Three barbarians and a druid. <laughs> yeah, if we're four people. Just have the gonna... druid occasionally go back and like kind of heal up a little bit, and then and then switch back to. You know. <laughs> Maybe we should have like a barbarian druid, multi class. Oh God. Oh no! You can't cast spells while raging. Well, that wouldn't um, cast... they really, really work. Well, that one doesn't have to rage, I think. That's true. I was actually, I, I thought, I figured out that if you were raging and then use wild shape, it would actually work. Because wild yeah, shape sucks. Yeah, yeah, spell. actually, that I, I read it. it yeah. Works. Wild I've shapes. seen that done before. I never seen it, but I read about it a lot, uh, a couple of times. So <laughs> it looks interesting. You squish my grass! Ah! <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh my god! Yeah. I, don't th I don't think we're gonna we're gonna bother Ash. <laughs> yeah. Special adventure for that. <laughs> Go right ahead. Roll anything you want. Hmm. 
I'm gonna do. This, I'm gonna do it very interesting. I'm gonna roll a dice for all the classes and the races. It's oh. random. Oh. Random yeah. Way. So I'm gonna. So it's gonna be like a random. It's thing. gonna be the worst possible oh, combination. Oh yes. <laughs> but it's gonna be. I think it's more fun and more challenging that way. It's like so. How did that um. Halfling, uh, a wizard come out. <laughs> I, I think like a I, halfling, I halfling barbarian would be like, holy, oh, okay. I will tell you only one thing: there will be ice. Ice, ice, baby. <laughs> no. Starts playing in the background. No. <laughs> oh yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> they he ripped that off from Queen and David Bowie. I do not acknowledge that song as a legitimate song. No, it's diff <laughs> it's different because of that at the end of it. It's dun dun yeah, dun have, you, have you not heard the seen the clip from the I court case? The court care. upheld it that he did not rip that off. He ripped it off. <laughs> not according to the law. <laughs> oh. The law is wrong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, your so side of your law. side of the law, maybe, but not ours. I am the law. <laughs> you have to do. You have to have more base. <laughs> that one. <laughs> <laughs> I can't get quite as. That's more as. gravel, not more base. <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay, so uh, well, en enough base, of the, no en people. enough of this now. <laughs> uh, let's continue on. We're wasting, we're losing time here. <laughs> okay, what a uh, come on, now. come on, guys. You wake up. You're feeling uh, stronger than you were the day before. What awesome. Do do? Yeah. Awesome. So, how do you? I'm still do... trying to figure out my other spell. That's why I was small talking. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and kind of figure out how, well, how am I stronger all, all of a sudden? Should I go see my um peeps? Uh, the um Emerald Enclave, and tell them about. Actually, I have a spell for this. There's a spell for that. There's a spell. I think we fast forwarded that part. How far is the rain? Oh, we? Be? Oh. I think so. That's why okay. you got a renown. Mm, yes. I did. Yeah, you got. You went back and told them why, and uh, then you head to the tavern. Well, after you oh, finished okay. with the scarecrows, you head uh, back to the emerald enclave uh, first, then go straight up to the tavern. You felt like yeah, that was the logical choice since you had. It was still time to do it. Spiritual weapon is a warlock spell. Yes, it is. What? You guys get spiritual it weapon. Can be, yeah. <clears throat> Gosh, I have to learn how to play a warlock soon. I always have that prepared. Nice. Uh, it's not in the compendium. What the hell is this? It should be. It's not? I cannot find it. It might not be from the player's handbook. If it's from if it's from like any of the supplementary ones. So if it's from like Xanathar's or one of the like Elemental Evil or one of the other things. I found then it, it won't be in the SRD. Is it? Spiritual weapon okay. is just a base yeah. spell. Yeah, spiritual weapon. Oh. I found it in the compendium. Know. Um, do you have, did you buy stuff as well? Have you bought, like, no. adventures? No? Okay. It's from SRD. Some... Some... There it is. is it? Yeah, cool. found it. There it is. Yeah, you found it. Oh my god, you have a, oh yeah, plus five, okay. I thought you had a plus five to wisdom, or charisma, no. Well. You didn't roll that high. What shall we do today? Yeah, what shall you do today? And uh, your 
new uh, workforce is still sleeping downstairs. Uh, I think okay. we need to figure out how to make some more before the, the bar opens up. You, you, you got the feel, yeah, you got the feeling that it's only uh, a few more days until you're opening. It's very close to the grand opening. Because and... we have to pay 518 gold to the bank a month, and we've made no gold. Oh god, we're going to jail. Uh, let's go out and see <laughs> if we can find any jobs. Uh, let's go to like Town Center. The market maybe has a, a board with like things to do. <laughs> yeah, it's a good idea. Let's do that. Uh, you want to do maybe wanted. find some downtime activities? For... I also still have this spell book we need to sell. Oh, we can use oh, that yeah. part oh, yeah. to pay back yeah. the bank as well. You have a you do have a spell book. You, you you guys don't have any need for spell books. No. Unless you no want to copy spells. No wizards. Uh, I am wizards. not going I'm, I'm not going to take that ritual thing as one of my invocations. Oh. I have no use for it. Really? I'm going to take the one where I never need to sleep ever again. Oh. <laughs> Priority. <laughs> I thought about it. I thought about it. That actually sounds like hell to me. Wait, seven. No, I'm no, just no, going. Like, yeah. I'm going to take that one, and then I'm going to like walk into other people's rooms and just watch them while they sleep. Yeah, watch but... them or uh, do I some pranks with everybody. No, just stand in the corner of the room and just watch them. Smoking a cigarette. <laughs> if you do that, I will actually give you advantage on those stealth checks. <laughs> Just so you know. Anyways, let's go to the market and see if there's any jobs we can do besides that. Okay. Uh, but first, uh, you guys haven't really checked out uh, your area where you live. I don't care about Qua? neighbors. Yeah, I don't really care either. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you should. <laughs> hey, there's a bunch of people here. Oh. Is there, like, a home association? Like, do we have to conform to, like, standards? Like, is no, there they're not there. I, I just forgot to do the uh, final do, do thing. Do we need? I uh, know, that was just one thing I did I mean... uh, a couple of weeks ago. <sighs> just doing some prepare stuff, like we GMs do. I don't. As a GM, I just, I just improv everything. Because uh. if we moved into a neighborhood with an HOA, I gotta say. <laughs> okay, but do you all? I want to leave. Do Do you all go out, or is some of you staying? I mean, if we're going to look for a job, I'm assuming we're all going. Yeah. Yes. I guess the yellow will stay. Okay. Uh. I can message her if we need her. I forgot how far that spell goes. Oh, whoops, I did not want to click that. Oh, well. Oh, I have to be in range. Damn. Should have taken sending. That's Ta -da. A good... You get that? I can't get I think sending is an actual spell spell. It's not a... I had animal messenger, and then I changed it before we started to hold person because I figured that'd be helpful and I took message as a cantrip. But now I'm regretting my decisions and everything about my life. Or just buy some sending stones. Well, um, you might. Maybe you could find some work in your own neighborhood. You never know. I think our GM okay. is trying to tell us. <laughs> Gail, you go to that door. I have no idea what you're talking that door. about. Just... Natalie, that door. <laughs> Do you really want me to talk to people by myself? Yeah, well, Good I point. You're coming with me. <laughs> so I'll go with Natalie. I guess I'm going alone. <laughs> okay, I'll go alone too. Just, just go everywhere. <laughs> okay, yeah. So you have uh, free reigns to go check this neighborhood out. Uh, yeah. There are a few shops. Uh, and... Uh, 
there might be some work you can find I in one of these shops. Either. And it, uh, <laughs> if it's if you manage to get a job in one of these shops, it's close by. You get you're close to home. Okay. So, Darren, when you go <laughs> down the street there, you see uh, uh, here uh, on the outside this building. Mm-hmm. Uh, you can see that there is a noise and a black sign featuring a cat's eyes. Inside is a regal apartment in a dim light by flickering oil lamps. Uh, when you say check the, if you check the door, uh, you, you can see it's locked and uh, and there's a sign, there's a little message next to the door. Knock before, uh, knock or ring the bell before being let in. Okay. Um, Does anybody have the knock spell? No, I would saw that one. Consider taking it too. <laughs> Unfortunately, Warlock, so I don't think get that because I didn't find it. Okay, I, I guess I'll um gingerly knock on the door. Okay, you open the door and you are met by uh, a fellow. Uh, you are met by this fellow. Oh, His he's so fancy. His name is Rash <laughs> Rax. Uh, Rakshasa. Rakshasa. I don't think that's his name. I think that's his species. Can I? Uh, oh, wait, who am I with? I think I'm with Natalie. Hey, his name yeah. is uh, Vincent Trench. He's a Rakshasa. They're just having Rakshasas walking around the city. Apparently, not even covering his, ident- not even covering it, his identity. That, 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 seem, that seems a little. Uh... <laughs> Uh, he, he introduces himself as uh, Rakshasa, uh, or uh, Vincent, Vincent Trench. God, can I, that can sounds I see so uh, American. That, I, I just have to, that sounds so American. Vincent Trench. I mean, Trench. Where, did, where did me and First Van go? Uh, yeah, where did we, we go? From where I am, can I see her? Is she maybe, within 120 feet? Can we go over here? Like... Yeah, you guys can see. Can I cast a spell message and be like, yo, Natalie, come here. I think you'll like this. I'm like casually pointing and not actually saying anything at Natalie. <laughs> okay, I come over. Hello, I am Derlin, and this is Natalie. She's not going to speak, but she'll observe. Do you have any odd jobs we could potentially do for you, sir? <laughs> Oh, oh my God! Flashback. Did you just did did you just so many flashbacks? <laughs> what did you oh. just uh, say that? Did, like customer service and like testing protocols and blah. <laughs> <laughs> oh good God! <laughs> Damn it, I can't get my snow to first. Oh my god. Uh, it's Natalie. so sad. It's so oh, sad too, because well, Natalie, if, if he's if he's not actually in disguise, if he's just literally out and out a rakshasa, uh, then not... she just wants to go, Kitty! Mm. <laughs> I had oh a feeling she was god. not going to be like, oh a scare away the potential Oh my employer. god. <laughs> Okay, so he introduces a, a Rakshasa by the name of Vincent Trench, a human detective. He he's a human detective and the owner of the Tiger's Eye. He speaks concisely, dresses in a sharp suit, and smokes a slim pipe. Vincent is in fact a Rakshasa named 
uh, uh, something else. I don't but, think you were supposed to tell us that. Yeah, well, he's not something else. He is a detective. Shall we pretend that we don't know that he's a Rakshasa? Mm, well, you get the... Uh, you got the handout, so... Sorry. I oh, we can pretend this is all about imagination. Mm. I have... Yeah, you can. This is a good before, way to so. role play. <laughs> <laughs> Just keep role playing. Imagination. <laughs> imagination. So did he his... come to the door as a uh, rakshasa or as a human detective? Uh, he's a uh, he's a human detective, Hello. and he is the owner of the Hello. the tiger's eye. Hey, Athena. Sorry, I'm late. Ah, no problem. Did you see my message earlier? No. <laughs> uh, we're playing one hour shorter today because I have to oh. get up 4 a.m. in the morning. Okay. Sounds I good. need I need my sleep because I'm have a busy day tomorrow. Okay, so you guys are level three. You know you're level three, right? I uh, hope you're <laughs> level up and fix your spouse uh -huh. and stuff. Great. You guys are checking out your neighborhood a little bit, looking for a little extra work. And uh, your brother just entered uh, a place uh, called the Tiger's Eye. They met by a human uh, by the name of Vincent Trench. And uh, he tells you, uh, asks you, mm. oh, hello, what can I do for you? So who's there? Darren. Okay. Darren. Carter! I, I, yes, I, sorry. I, I'm, I'm also there, but yeah. apparently I'm not supposed to speak, so I'm staying quiet. Why? Well, yeah. Okay. What, what can I do for you? Uh, we are trying to find odd jobs, and we were wondering if you had anything you could potentially have us do. Hmm. Um, I'm... Normally, you're the one... Uh, uh, people come to me uh, to ask me for a job. You see, I'm a detective. I investigate for others. Okay. <laughs> uh, so is that a no? <laughs> well, do you... Uh, uh, are you a detective? Uh, do you... Uh... Do you feel that you can uh, uh, investigate and find stuff that normally can't be found by normal people? Well, sir, uh, I believe, yes, yes, we are very good at investigating. My, my friend here is very, she's amazing at finding things. My investigation score is kind of low. <laughs> <laughs> so you're kind of whispering that and he just yeah it uh, just gives you the look a little bit hmm. and another friend of mine has something to locate any object locate I point at Gail and cast this message and say come here <laughs> locate object you say but um, I'm more of a people person I am miss I'm looking for uh I'm mostly hired to I'm good at that. Hi find people that don't want to be found. I uh my sister's good with people and I point and cast message again and say please come here. <laughs> I'm gonna keep using the spell because damn it, I'm okay, gonna have a I'll use for come. it. Mm. I like people. Yeah, I also do. Hello. Have a, he, hello. Oh, you are a bunch of people here. Hmm. Yes. <laughs> we oh. need a job. <laughs> wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait We're a, minute. a bit wait a desperate. Minute. Wait a minute here. Are you the new owners of Trollskull Manor? 
Uh, I know no, what no. you're talking about. No idea. Wait, what? 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 No. Are we not supposed what? to tell him that information? I'm the owner. <laughs> the owner's over there. Oh. He just simply works Good. there. Have you? Wait, hold on. Have you heard of my services? And I'm gonna. <laughs> I, 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 I have not. What kind of services do you offer? Oh, well, for... Back to know, business. Well, anyway, moving on. I pull out a folder this with, is like... <laughs> this, yep, that is business. Oh. Well, uh, I also do discover secrets in Waterdeep. I'm very good at discovering deep secrets, deep dark secrets in the city. For a, for a you few, know who else course. is good at doing that? A hose. Mm, hose. Hose. hose uh... They're also very good about finding deep dark secrets. I mean, she's not wrong. Well, no, technically she's not. So. <laughs> I, I mean, know. do you know how much money, like, madams have made just dealing in secrets? <laughs> yeah, see? See? I would be the perfect employee for you, sir. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, God. <laughs> you guys, so you guys are going to have, like, a competition with... But, but the difference between <laughs> you and uh, this detective is that you have to work from your from uh, the manor. This guy can work everywhere in Waterdeep. But that just well, means she doesn't advantage. have to she do gets... any leg work. Yeah. No, she does plenty of leg work. Just, you know. <laughs> oh, yeah. Um, good she one. She gets to work yeah. from home. <laughs> that's it's a good gig one. economy. Oh, good one. Oh, my God. That's a good one. Oh, oh boy. <laughs> I mean, uh, it depends on what package they ask for. Ah, uh, yeah. Definitely. <laughs> That's true. It's true. Crazy. Uh, okay, back to business here. Yeah. Back to business. Who says that was the wrong phrase? Okay, I was uh, being serious. I'm confused. Mm. Does wow. that not get his interest? <laughs> I feel like he'd want that type of spy. You have to pose for him. Uh, I started to take off my shirt. <laughs> you have about three seconds. You have about three seconds before you freeze to death. Uh, I gotta put my shirt winter. back on. <laughs> right. Yeah, it's it's winter. Yeah. I didn't mean that kind of posing, Jayla. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just thought he wanted to see the goods. I, my bad. My bad. Uh, um, <laughs> yeah, but the, 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 you, you do know the law of the city, right? And I'm asking that as a GM. What? You know the not law? No, strip, the not law stripping city. nude. <laughs> I'm going to add Wait, that no, extra. No stripping in the streets. <laughs> you can't be a hoe. Six months in jail. In the streets. Then just not in the streets. Oh. Um, keep okay. it in the street. In the Got streets. Got it. Not Sorry. My bad. Okay. Mm. Yeah. Anyway, I have a very wide network and I feel like I could be useful to you. <sighs> really? Network. Well, normally <laughs> I. You have an op. Then. You are mm. the ones that hire me for services. If you want okay. to find, if you want to find certain people, or certainly you know certain secrets, I'm your man. All right, noted. <laughs> so, Let's Natalie, um, would up. you like to go talk to? Um, hold up, I have her name. Just a second. Uh, We're looking for Mule's today. Like to, oh, okay. I was gonna. Well, she and I can go talk to Yagra because we haven't like done the final. Thing for our um, Harper, not Harper. I am far yeah. too busy getting drunk. Let's just. <laughs> well, you actually, you have done your second level uh, quest. Already. Yeah. We it were, was the talking. Yeah. It oh. was the opera and the talking, talking horse. horse. Yeah. Right. Okay. Cool. So you have your uh, re uh, renowned, reowned. 
point. How much renown do we have? You have one each. Okay. For finishing your quests on second where, level. Where was I putting that? Okay. So put that on your sheet somewhere and remember them. Well, if there's anything else uh, you, you need, just come and ask. You know, right now I have a case to work, uh, work on. So if you don't have any cases for me, come back later. And he shuts the door. Jerk. Walks away. <laughs> Yeah, well, you can uh, actually have a discussion later about this detective that he might get be useful if you uh, if you, there are certain people you want to f uh, know about want to be found. He only, he only takes a small fee. We have one gold in the party fund. That out, out party. of out of all this gold that we have. <laughs> All that gold goes straight into the manor. Oh, so you guys are broke again. Cool. Yep. We have two gold. Wait, sorry. Seven gold, 82 silver, and 50, 250 copper from the party bank. And two pushes of healing. The wow. five gold is for the thugs to be paid I for. I mean, you borrowed 6,000 gold. And oh, you God, only so needed, good. and you only needed like five, four or five thousand. Well, we so can we go have an extra thousand gold. We can go sell the book and then go try and find a listing for a, I don't know, kill this band of goblins or something. Mm. What book are we selling? Spell book. Yeah. So where do you guys want to go next? Isn't there a library down here? That we rented a book from a little while ago. I don't think he was like buying books. Though. And uh, there book? was uh, down here. He sold books. Down here is. Uh, <laughs> uh, like, um, you can see a sign of. Uh, it has. Like herbs and uh it's how it's it has a sign that uh, reminds you of uh ap apothecary or a physician that's a good place it's like a more like a potion shop <gasps> maybe they'll take my creature parts <laughs> Creature part? Oh, yeah, well, maybe. My goblin hair and teeth and blood and my Tarkar eye. <laughs> that I still have. You also have blood. Yeah. Go goblin yeah, blood. Streaming. It's in my flask. That I want back eventually. Yep. Uh, so... Yeah, you knock on the door, uh, the door is open, and you are met by uh, a wood elf with long braided hair. And of course, there's no hand for her. Uh, she introduces herself as Fala uh, Lefalier. Hello. Okay. Ah, uh, she. Hello. What can I do for you? Uh, Natalie. <laughs> I have things to sell. Take my things. Oh, what kind of things? I just like start pulling crap out of my bag. <laughs> What kind of crap do you take out it's from that the, bag? It's the goblin hair, the goblin, goblin teeth, literal feet, feet, goblin blood, and the Duragar eye. 
Oh. Mm. Mm, those looks interesting. Where did, uh, where did you get these? You know, off of Goblin Zs and a Durgar. Pretty sure it was one Durgar. Yeah, it was one. Also, we're going to need that flask back. Hmm, that... Uh, that might, might be no problem. That's not going to be a problem at all. I do like the uh, these ingredients you're showing me. It could be useful for maybe something I can make. How much? How much do, how much do you want for them? What's the going rate? A hundred gold. <laughs> A thousand gold. Mm. Well, goblin. <laughs> Uh, this Durgar eye, um, that's very interesting. I haven't, I don't, I don't know many Durgars in the city. Well, there's one less now. <laughs> True, or you, you just pick the eye out and let him live. There's still one eye then. No, I'm pretty sure he's dead. Was he dead? Yeah, the he other was eye. dead. Huh? Hmm. Well, oh, yeah, that's yeah. right. He was, yeah, his that whole side of his face was gone. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Yeah, that's right. Mm. Well. Didn't I slit someone's throat, too? My uh, goblin. Yeah, you did. In his sleep. <laughs> yeah, you did. That's how we got the blood. Yeah, you critted him. Oh, like, yeah. you, you just sliced the whole throat open. So the memories. Blood. Yeah. <laughs> Those were the memories, yes. Your first goblin kill. Ever. Murder. <laughs> Murder. This is not this is this is not Acquisitions Incorporated and Jim <laughs> and Jim Dark Magic's home. Murder. Uh, well, hmm. Durgar eyes are sure hard to find. Uh, I'm gonna give you a special prize for that eye. What do you say about oh. 18 gold pieces for that eye? 19. She looks, she turns her eyes and head towards you and gives you a stare, like a dead eye stare. If they're so rare, then you shouldn't mind. That's why I keep offering her 18 gold. How, how much for all of it? <laughs> For the goblin pieces and I, twenty-five gold pieces. Okay, can, can we get the blood out of the flask, though? Absolutely. Okay. Uh, is there anything do you would like to see? Yeah, I do have a um, stock of potions if you're interested. Nope. Twenty-five gold, please. Yep. Yep. That's. Wait, I have a question, and I'm going to pull out my little fairy and ask if she has anything that would revive it. Hmm. That is... You, uh, that, uh, that's going to be hard with a potion. I'm sorry, you're going to need a very powerful healer if you want to resurrect that old fairy. Do you know of any? Not that comes to mind, no. Sorry, I can't be any more help, but... Uh... That's okay. Do you have any jobs that you would like us to do? As a group, we're kind of looking for a little bit of work. Like, would you like us to go down to the river, pick some mushrooms, get you some more well, potion making? Well, you, if you find more interesting ingredients, I'm more than how... Uh... I'm more than eager to buy it for a good price. I start turning out my pockets, <laughs> but I have nothing. Well, there's no rush. You don't have to rush. But if you find, uh, if you if you find any rare 
uh, if you get uh, in the hold of ingredients that might be useful for my shop, for my herbs and potions, I'm more than happy to buy them from you. To the sewers! What? Yeah, I was, I would, that's exactly <laughs> what I was thinking. Should we just go back down to the sewers and like start killing things and like desecrating yeah. their bodies? <laughs> or, I mean, the other option would be to go to a faction and ask for a mission. That is true. Did we never get any parts from those uh, the spectator we fought? Or the scarecrow? No, the spectator in the sewer. Oh. Or was it a gazer? Yeah. The gazer. We didn't get anything from that. Uh, yeah. No, because it just sank into the water and floated away. We should have looked for it. How foolish we were. We were foolish. Yeah, that, mm, that to the body should, would, <laughs> pro is probably a long gone. It's probably spilled out somewhere. Or been eaten by other sewer monsters. So... If there's nothing more I can do for you, uh, please yeah, come again. Yeah, I grab the gold and I give Gale back his flask. Mm. <laughs> I suggest, you know, washing this out before you use it again. I will. Well, Fala, uh, Lefalier, thanks for, uh, thanks for. Thank you for the ingredients and wish you a good cold day. This cold so nights, that's... dark, cold times. And uh, Fala closes the door and goes back in. 25 gold for the party fund. Yes, I will actually... add that. Yeah. Oh, you're not gonna take it from for yourself. Well, we need to pay off the loan, monthly loan. Uh, well, so we you still you still have time for it. You you still have time. We're at twenty seven. We're on a roll. You said we spent twenty no five thousand gold, and we took a loan of six thousand gold, which we have an extra thousand gold. We could use half of that to pay back this month's loan. Yeah, I mean... And yeah. then spend the rest on stuff. Me too. Uh, let's see. Wait, where did the thousand gold come from? Because well, the... the what was required to like repair the tavern and get all of the supplies and hire everyone was like a little over 5000 it wasn't 5000 even it was a little over 5000 yeah so we took out 6000 yeah so you should have at least uh, not le you should have uh, between five hundred and s uh, maybe seven hundred gold pieces left. Yeah, just in case, just in case we couldn't make the payment this month. Yeah, so you're paying a loan uh, with the loan. That's. <laughs> <laughs> you know. That just in case. Just in case, yeah. I'd like to try and get the money mm. by doing other things. Okay, so that way we can keep that extra money. Yeah. But absolutely. So where to next? Where do you go explore next in your little alleyways? Does anyone want to go to their faction and try and get a job, or are we gonna go back down to the sewers? Um, I'm up here talking to more of our neighbors, whoever these people are. Yeah, they're just uh, normal neighbors, uh, not much. But if you go... Uh, if, uh, closer to here, uh, this direction, 
Yeah, you I'm just walking down the street. Yeah. yeah. Just going from, literally going from door to door just to say hello. We're we're living in Troll Skull Manor now. It's going to be opening up again as a tavern. Yeah, um, you blah, can blah, blah. In, You can see a charming sign of a gold dragon curled around a treasure hoard of books and scrolls. Uh, just outside here on the walls. Okay, I will wander over and have a look. And well, Whipperforth will very much wander over and have a look. Yeah, so when you get there, you see inside a window, you can see a shop. It's decorated with beautiful hard wood. And uh, you can also see books, old books. It's like a library. It's filled with thousands of books. Okay, so I sort of I go in and I poke around, and is there anybody about? Uh, yes, there is. You have to excuse me, I don't have any maps for this. That's okay, it's a, li it's a bookshop slash library. Yes. I imagine shelves and books. Oh, yes. Okay, uh, so I sort of call out and uh, see you see there's a man in uh, behind the counter on the uh, first floor he uh, you can see that he is a short dragonborn of uh, with his skin is like shining like not with silver or something but more like gold cool I, he I introduces you, himself as moral, a, so. he he introduces himself as Rishal the Page Turner. Well met, Sir Rishal. Hello. Welcome to my bookshop. <laughs> and a fine bookshop it is. Yes. I am here for my boon companion Whipperforth, and I gesture up to my to Whipperforth, who is sitting on my shoulder. Oh, that is a lovely dragon. Oh, oh, oh yes, yes th th thanks, thanks so much. So nice, so nice to meet another dragon type person. Ah, <gasps> uh, uh, do you have any have any books on history? Oh, that we do. We have have two floors of books for you to look at. You feel oh, free oh, to come oh, in oh, and. Uh... Uh, 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 I'll be right back, and he jumps off my shoulder and just like just goes flying in mm. yeah so we before you can just fly around and and uh, look at all the books and you can see uh, he just flies everywhere in light speed yeah he's he's much like me in a bookshop where he's just trying to read all of the titles of everything <laughs> that he sees he uh, he also found jump out to him. He gives you uh, telepathic uh, notes that he said, Pressman, Pressman, I found mm -hmm. some magical books and scrolls. Cool. And very good. I go and have a look at them. What do I see? Uh, you can see uh, uh, books and scrolls containing spells for uh, wizards and and, uh, and so uh, all kinds of magic uh, from containing warlocks and uh, some uh, maybe even contain druids and clerics, warlocks, sorcerers. All kinds of spells, uh, mostly scrolls, but there are also books. And on that shell, it says uh, there's a sign that copies uh, spells for copying. So you get the feeling that uh, this uh, bookshelf with scrolls, uh, uh, with spells and stuff, are meant for people that they can 
probably pay a fee and copy spells for their books. Or even uh, spell scrolls. <laughs> I didn't want to buy. So that's what uh, that is what he tells you, and that's what you see. That's on the second floor. Richal, uh, patron, comes up and asks you, Oh, have you found anything interesting? I see you found my book of spells, uh, my sh bookshelf of spells. Are you a spellcaster? Persevate. Hello, Persuade. Can you can you can you hear me now? Yeah. Okay, sorry, I was talking. Okay. But apparently you couldn't hear me. Yeah. Um, I was just saying it's Whipperforth is looking for things for him. I'm I'm not like Persuade is not super interested. Uh, Whipperforth wants like some uh, basic history type texts for like Waterdeep. And um, sort of like something similar to the city guide that I think was a Volo wrote in the back of the Dragon Heist campaign book. Oh, yeah. So he's looking for something similar to that um, because he's not. You like, meant uh, like uh, the knows Volo's the, guide to knows... monsters. Hmm. No, 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 like Volo's yeah, Guide to answer. Waterdeep. Volo's Guide to Waterdeep. Yeah, because he's already... So, you know that thing that's in the back? It's like the appendix in Waterdeep Dragon Heist. There's a whole section on uh, Waterdeep and stuff. Something similar to that. Because Persevane knows Waterdeep to a certain extent from... At, let's just say at, at a certain strata. But in terms of like a more general... Uh, co or comprehensive view, Persephone doesn't know that stuff. Uh, has a lot of functional knowledge of the city, but not like a, necessarily a lot of historical knowledge. And so that's what Whipperforth is after. So I... general, basically, general histories of Waterdeep, um, city guides, that kind of stuff. The uh, what is it? The the Lonely Planet Guide to Waterdeep. Lonely Planet Guide to Waterdeep. Uh, huh. mm. He just uh, tells him, hmm, I'm going to have to take a look around. It I heard of the book, uh, but mm, I, I think I have to get back to you on that when I found it, uh, find it. I'm not sure where it is. Uh, as you can see, I have thousands and thousands of books, and it's little like a small city library when it comes to books. Well, have no fear. We are located proximally. In the troll skull manner, so we should be back in here. His eyes just fling most frequently. His eyes just shines, and so is his golden scales. That uh, oh, so you're the one that opens uh, has opened up uh, troll skull manor, the tavern. I am one of a brave party of adventurers. Yes. I am oh, one of them. Have However, you? Have you opened I am it? not the owner, so to speak. Have, have no, you, soon. Have you soon. opened it However, yet? We shall distribute pamphlets most alacritously. 
Yeah, but have you opened uh, the tavern? Is it open for business? Not yet. Oh, let me know. I'm quite a drinker. I do miss Most a good day. Certainly. You <laughs> alcoholic, you. <laughs> I'm not there. I remember that. Yeah, I know you're not there. Uh, but mm, let me get back to you on this book, uh, The History of Water Deep. And he makes a promise that uh, he will definitely get back to you. He will, he will leave a note in your tavern if you're not there. Cool, cool. Um, and then, yeah, we'll, we'll head out and... Um, I will head out and whip a fourth wheel... Uh, sort of go up and get a bird's eye view, as it were, dragon's eye view, uh, to see if he can see the others. Yeah, and if he gets about 80 feet, 80 or 90 feet up, he can uh, see the silhouettes of the gangs down here. All right, cool. And now we'll wander down to join them then. Well, uh, do you and uh, Pres- uh, Whipperford know about uh, Natalie and his, her obsession of selling the magic book? No. We are just sort of like, well, we've sort of covered this street, so now we'll go and have a chat to the others. Okay, you can go down and have a chat with ours. What do, uh, what do the rest of you do while uh, Presswain and Whipperforth are... Checking out this bookstore or library. Bookstore library. I'd imagine it would be like the same time we were talking yeah. to the potion shop on. Probably. Yeah, uh, yeah, it, but, uh, yeah definitely. You guys time. are finished uh, and uh, you you get outside freezing. It's freezing outside. <laughs> Shall we go to the sewers? You literally... Should we get our missing party member first? Perhaps. Sorry, that was here. Okay, so <laughs> there is no visible entrance to the sewers in your neighborhood. Well, I mean, we'd walk down to it where we knew the entrance was at. Yeah, that was also... uh, that was outside the Yoming portal. And... Yeah. Yeah, and outside uh, another and uh, the shop where you found your beholder. This but... this is the fantasy world, though. Everyone walks everywhere. I'm assuming we can walk there. Or, like, yeah, can you can walk there. Uh, definitely, you can <laughs> definitely walk there. It ain't like now where we need to go. Oh my god, we need to get in the car and drive there. <laughs> I'm too lazy to walk. Why are there two Athenas? I'm not sure why. <laughs> It it's a be new bit possible. for for her hoeing days. Yeah, it's a that spell. Was, she knows it's there. It should only be one now. <laughs> I just have to copy you guys over to this map. <laughs> Jesus, give me some you slack now, sewer. will ya? <laughs> Never. Ah, we can go Never. to the sewers, or we could go talk to our guilds. Oh my God, I. So you either go to the sewers or talk to your guilds. Sewers would be easier. Just go down there and murder things. Yeah, thank but we you get for benefits that. from our guilds. Murder. Yeah, you probably get They're to murder things murder. from guild your... then murder. You can mm. probably fi- uh, get to murder stuff if you go to the go to your guilds. Uh, thank you for not. Right. Uh, this this is like GM's nightmares. Uh, going <laughs> stuff places and uh, where GMs not have uh, prepared maps for. Me. Oh <laughs> my god! So who wants to go to their guild? My guild probably won't give us any money. That's the thing. Well, well, my I, I doubt the, the har- I doubt the Harpers will have any money to give, or want you to kill. Yeah. Oh, my guild will probably want me to kill some monsters. Let's go to yours! <laughs> yeah. Let's go to yours! If anyone else has any 
Are there other ideas I'm open to here before we head to my guild? Not really. <laughs> nah. I got nothing. It is always the yawning portal. A good place to seek adventure. Uh, yeah. Definitely. Could do so. that. And the sewers are right near it, too. What is your obsession with, obsession with the sewers? Monsters. Monsters. There. Murder. <laughs> All right. Actually, no, I don't want to go in the sewers. Last time we went down there, we saw a mind flare. I mean, that's no, you did see a mind. Oh yeah, oh yeah, you did see a mind flare. That's true. That's where we know for sure that there are monsters in town. Otherwise, we're going to have to go out of town, and then we're just going to have to wander around. And it's not guaranteed that we'll actually see anything. Or get a lot Maybe of money. Like, like this is like random encounter. <laughs> I mean, if you really want to, we can go try to find that mind flare and try to kill it. We know how to get to it. Oh, yeah. Go through those, go through those halflings home. Oh, yeah. You just break into their house. <laughs> go through their basement. And then find the mind flare and kill it and then take its body back over here. That's definitely an option. So you want to go a find brain. a mind flare? We're high enough yes. levels. I can do it. Yeah. I I, I mean I mean if you want to find a mind flare, like you sure you could like go and try and find one, but mm, I wonder uh, what the odds are you actually gonna find a mind flare. Well, I know we can get to that big room, and there was that locked door. Oh, yeah. Oh, you want to go back to the hideout? That, that big room mm -hmm. that that uh, one dude escaped through, and we couldn't get it through the door, or we just didn't want to. Okay. We just left. Do you, do you want to go visit the Hoffling family and use their basements as well? For point mm -hmm. of entry? <laughs> Yeah, why not? I'm sure that'll make Diella happy. Is Diella even here? I haven't heard her for in a while. Athena. Oh my god, my mic was muted that whole time. What yep. the fuck? I was yep. totally like partaking in the conversation. Okay, I'm annoyed. <laughs> Sorry guys. I was like here and responding, but like nothing I said needed a response back. So, like, I just assumed you guys could hear me. Uh, well, okay, so everything you just said to yourself, what did you meant to say to us? Speak up, Diana. <laughs> you, have the, you have the floor or the chair. Oh, I was just I was just laughing at, like, the joke that they said, and then he was like, I feel it like that, and I was like, yep. And, I mean, that was it. It wasn't things that needed, like, responses, so that's why I thought you guys could hear me. Oh, damn, we missed the laugh. Sorry. <laughs> no Let's say you first, Finn. Yawning portal or the sewer to try to fight that monster? Uh, I vote yawning portal. Because... Oh, wait, hang on. So, the... The options are yawning portal or we go and look at the room where we fought a mind... Or you guys fought a mind flyer. Mm -hmm. Right. Uh, or yeah, I, I, well, well, you actually, uh, yeah, you that. didn't fight uh, fight the mind flayer. The mind flayer just left you guys with uh, the intellect devourer and the half orc magician. Uh, ah, yeah. we should see if the intellect devourer is still there. Harvest oh, the body. body. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Yeah, okay, it's been like. Maybe 12, 13 days. Uh, between 12 and 15 days. Uh, yeah, since you really were there. Cold. It's really cold. Yeah. Yeah, but it's damp down there. We'll see. Can... We'll, Why we'll didn't we harvest that? Uh, somebody was like really hurting, I think, at that point. 
Oh, it was me. Because I was yeah. thinking everything. Yeah, I remember yeah. now. Anyway. Yeah, the, mind, the, the intellect of uh, the devourer were trying to eat your brain or your intellect. But he failed quite a lot. So we have Yawning Portal, Sewer, Guild. And it seems like the guild is like the least favorable option with you guys. So Yawning Portal or Sewer. I tell you what, guys. Uh, I'm going to roll a d4. And uh, three and four are. Let's go check out that room. Three and four are the sewers, and one, two is the young portal. What does Wiverforth want to do? Uh, he'll, he's curious about lots of stuff, so he's just kind of along for the ride. He doesn't have a strong opinion on this one. Okay. I mean, I don't care either. Somebody choose. I think sewers was the best option checking out that room. I, I'm also for checking out with. that room. Okay. Yeah, I'd like to check out the room. Okay. All right, I guess we're going to the room. Oh, yeah. Oh, also, I tell everyone that there's a bookshop. <gasps> like, nearby. Where? I tell her where. And also that there's spells that you, that you can copy. Yeah, person I tells you that the spells, they, I just want the books, and I grab them. The per, uh, person tells them. you that uh, it's uh, along <laughs> this road. Just a few houses, like six houses, along the street, uh, down the street. So I take it you're going there. So we're, going first. To, we're going to the room. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, but are you going to sell your book first? No, we're going no. to the room. Oh, uh, okay. You guys are going to the room. Oh, hi, Mark. <laughs> I, did I, did not not. I did not. I did not. I did not. Did not do what? He did not hit her. He did not. It's from the movie. Have you never seen the the masterpiece, The Room? The Room. Uh, no. <gasps> Do yourself a favor and watch that watch movie. It. What, oh uh, what, what, what movie? What movie? The Room. The it's Room. So terrible. Bad. <laughs> It's oh my god! It's it's I, essentially famous because it's the shittiest movie on the face of the planet. Okay, so it's that is kind it, of movie it goes that like I right fell back asleep around to. to funny. I just have to like flip through and uh, get so bored I almost fell fall asleep. No, it's absurd. You're gonna watch it and just it's laugh. It's absurd. Yeah. Oh god. Maybe it's I, like trolls too. Uh, it's like watching a train wreck. You just can't walk away. <laughs> Good God! <laughs> I wonder One of my favorite lines: like uh, "Wandering encounters." The mother-in-law. I have breast cancer. Oh. <laughs> and then they just drop the plot. Okay, she says she has breast cancer, and that's there's. And that's then that's it. it. And then it's never resolved. <laughs> What that happens a lot fuck? in that movie. I, oh, that I hate those kind of movies. Movie. I hate those Dude, kind of movies where there's no like n no. Watch actual like a end. review of it first. Watch your review first, because if you can get through the review, you can get through the movie. Okay. Uh, well, I will give. I uh, I will give it a try after my shift tomorrow. I will promise you that. I will even send a, a video that I watched it. Personally, I recommend the OSW review. Review. Uh, they normally do wrestling shows, but it's three Irish lads, and it's hilarious. Anyways, to the sewers. 
to the sewers. Indeed. Yeah, Indeed. To, the to the sewers. sewers. Okay. Let's get dirty. Oh my god. Dale okay, so you get to you okay, so you get to the uh family and uh where you uh found the entrance. Let's see, one, two, three, four. We're missing we're missing the first event. Yeah. Oh, I had two hit points. That's where yeah, I level, uh, oh, yeah, yeah, level up these uh, tokens, guys. I am far beyond this. Now. I cannot see these tokens. That's because They're you're in not the top there. Right. Oh. Also that. <laughs> Still no. There well, you are. Yeah, but it's dark down there. There's no light. So you have no dark you have no dark vision. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing with this. I messed up. Oh. What? What are you trying to do, Athena? Oh wait, never mind. Uh, you guys are trying to like look around the old hideout where you fought the intellect of our and uh, the Gromshar. Yeah, I still can't see anything. Yeah, because so. it's uh, dark. It's I, dark. I'm aware that it is dark. However, presumably somebody bought a light. I also have produced cast, flame. I'm gonna cast light. Perseverance shield. Uh, cool, I'm happy with that. <laughs> Whipperforth has dark vision though. Is Whipperforth still back here with me? Cause that's where he's hanging out. No, he's hanging on my, on my shoulder where he normally lives. Okay, cause then you need to move him. I can't see him. Oh. Wait. Where are you at? Yeah, Good question. You're, Don't you're know. Up here. Yeah, I see you. I'm right next to you. <laughs> As am I. Same here. Let's see. The what's, the, what's, the, what's the radius of the light spell? What does... Uh, what's uh, I can... uh, uh, 30, I would assume. I think it's 30. It's like a thousand feet. <laughs> 20 foot uh, radius of uh, bright 20. light and 20 of dim. So four. I, I also produced flame light. going, which there you go. gives a 10 foot radius. Oh. You should be able to see now. Do you see anything, Preservain? Oh, hang on a sec. I'm getting. Is anyone else getting, like, juddery music? Oh yes, because you're in the sewers. Super yeah, well, I'm getting the music, but the problem is that it's it's not like it's laggy. It's yeah, it's sort of juddering. Uh, 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 is it uh, dub stepping? Can't, well, <laughs> not not in a fun way. It's not. I still not can't see anything. Not an intentional way. <laughs> can't you see? Yeah, this? like in the sense of like it's ir irritating and laggy. I might just there you go. Mute it. Mute that. There you go. Tab. That's better. I just shut it off. I can. Oh, okay. I also <laughs> muted the tab. Uh, okay, you should be able to see. Where now. is Whip? Where is Whipperforth? He is Let's back see. here with Don't me. Don't move! God damn it, Athena! <laughs> Stop it, Athena! God damn it! <laughs> I'm trying to like, fix no, you some. If you if you move back into uh this room. I am trying. Hang on a second. Let me switch methods here. It's gonna switch to my tablet. Oh, oh yep, there he is. Yeah. I got him. Ah, shit. Okay. Just stay where you are in the basement for now. I would suggest you let me or Persevering leave. They don't know what day. Yeah. We're good. 
can stay change where you are. Stay where you are. No. I, I, <laughs> bravely, I can see where the secret door is. Yeah. It's here. Yeah, definitely. Uh, what the shit is this? Uh, when you get into the tunnel, <laughs> into the secret tunnel. You hear like uh, some quirking sound. You not really it's some not really sound, sorry? You hear like uh, uh God damn it. You you hear like uh, there's frogs in here? Like, seems odd. Uh, a group of frogs are rivet, 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 rivet. Do they seem to be demonic frogs? <laughs> Can we strip them for parts? <laughs> you actually don't know because you don't see them. Unless anybody's watching his stream. <laughs> Clearly, invisible frogs. <laughs> oh my you're, you're, my viewer, you're my viewer. You're my viewer. Oh, shame on me. you. I'm supporting. Yeah, I'm I I not supposed to be watching. I know. I'm supporting you. Yeah, I know you are. I know you are. Okay. <laughs> I like your reaction. You're my viewer. <laughs> Like, I, 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 I actually know that Ash has been spying on me as well so a few times. Well, I have. I Are don't you think stream sniping? I just like We've to be in the chat. Game, guys. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta get in and out. Are you stream sniping? No. <laughs> totally not. Never. Of course not. I would never do that. Don't worry, I would never watch your stream. Giant toads. <laughs> you just had to say it. Let's go get some slime. <laughs> we can cut their tongues out. Uh, Harvest them for parts. <laughs> cut their, their big eyes out. <laughs> See if, if it helps at all. I don't snacks. know what enemies are yet. So like. I see the what it is, but I don't know what it is, if that makes any sense. I have no idea how powerful it is or anything. <coughs> Let's go. Yes. <laughs> Move forward. Can't can't get through until. So please don't metagame now, please. Okay. Since we can hear the You frogs, you hear yeah, the frogs, yes, you do. You Can I make frogs. a perception check to see how close they are? Uh, that you can. 21. With disadvantage, because it's an echo. Ah, uh, well then. <laughs> Six. Mm, you can hear like a ribbit, like hey, an echo of several frogs, but it's like an echo in the tunnels. You know there's uh, frogs there, but you don't know if they're big or small. All right. Well, they're just frogs. I'm sure yeah. it's fine. Yeah. Let's go, guys. Yeah. So uh, you have to walk uh, like this way because uh, you, this is like underneath the water line. Oh, okay. I can see the frog. 
Yes, you can see the frog. And it's pretty big. <clears throat> he's gonna take a leap towards you when he spots you. Giant frog. Dale is gonna squeal Ugh. and move back. <laughs> <laughs> I shall take a step forward and say, Halt, frog. Uh, he jumps right at you, and uh, we, and all of you roll initiative for this one. <laughs> always roll super low. Yep. Oh. Well, I traditionally uh, yeah, but the toads which is a uh, rolled even lower, so. With last. <laughs> so this toad jumps right at you, Persevane. Uh, I'm cool with that. <laughs> uh, Dayala. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, I squealed and walked back. <laughs> you squealed and walked back. Okay. My so you're like is running you're... away. <laughs> okay, so you, your action is just, ah, uh, yeah, fuck I'm this. not I, running I... away, I'm just like, uh, fuck I'm yes, I'm not fucking, I'm not fighting frogs. No way. Yeah, those are slimy and gross. I'm going to chill here. So... I turn and look uh, at you well, like, oh, come on. <laughs> I'm going to ready, um... Sorry, it's been a while since I played this character. Just a second. I will ready Firebolt. Okay. Oh, and guys, yeah. just so you know, the scales of these frogs are, don't match because they are usually this big. Just so you know. Wait, I didn't gotcha. see it. Do it again. They're like the size of my dire wolf. Oh, you haven't seen that yet. Um. They are the size. So they, it's, the they are. They are usually. The they point. are this size, but uh, the Ew. it's too. Yeah, it's it's uh, so small. This this chamber is so small, so I narrowed it down. But they are actually large. To keep that in mind. Keep that in mind, guys. Actually, I can do this. Just for you guys. Ah, just for us what? Fuck it. Ah, I could have doubled the size of the map. Ah, shit. It. So, Dela, you are prepare. You're readying a firebolt. Yep. Anything else you want to do? No. Nope. I mean, I squealed and walked away. Okay. <laughs> Nelly, what do you do? Uh. That thing is in a really bad place, and I can't see it, really. Like, I can barely see the edge of it. Yeah. So... Well, I mean, in reality, you would be able to see it because they're massive. Yeah, you would, actually. Yeah, probably. Hmm... I'm gonna. Sure, why not? I just got it. I'm gonna use vicious mockery on it. <laughs> why not? <laughs> okay. This is happening in a number of locations all over the world. Vicious mockery, DC 14. I'm gonna mock it for being a big, dumb, stupid frog. Well, it rolled a three, so it takes four damage. I said it's a big, dumb, stupid frog. And apparently it didn't like that, so it got a headache from it. Hmm, <laughs> yeah. And, yeah. And that's your turn? That's, uh... Let's see here. 
that was a cantrip. Can I cast a spell? As a yes, bonus uh, bo action? yeah. So bonus action, you can cast a spell. Oh no! Wait, yeah, I can. I can still cast it because all my spells are second level. Yeah, you can. So uh, matter, technically, you can cast a uh, spiritual weapon. Since that's yeah, a bonus action. That's what I want to do. Yeah. Okay. And you can do yeah. uh, Doesn't it do damage cast? immediately? I have no idea. Well, I wanted to try and get the thing up there, but it just immediately cast it, so. I think it does do damage as soon as it comes out. Yes, it does. Oh, let's see here. Um, when you cast a spell, you can make a melee spell attack against a creature within five feet of the weapon. What does this target. weapon look like? It looks like a big book. Uh, actually, you can have <laughs> you can have this uh, token here. This uh, so uh, this, spir the, this spiritual uh, weapon token. It's a big book. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm gonna it's, fix. Yeah. You. I'm actually gonna fix you a, <laughs> a spiritual weapon book token. <laughs> I had the same spiritual weapon for my cleric. A, a big book. A big book. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Because her background is sage, and yeah, that's actually how she fell into the pact. Was she just accidentally read the wrong book? Yeah. Well, twelve hits, so roll damage. Big old five. Big old five. Big old five. five damage. Oh, good. I don't think I'm gonna get a chance to hit it. <laughs> that's. I'm gonna just fly it on back there, and that's my turn. <laughs> Persevain, you're up. Yes, uh, so that's a carpet, right? That's not like a table. This is a carpet, yes. Okay. Long red carpet. That's fine. I'm gonna move up next to El Senor Frog. <laughs> um, and these bodies are not here. Well, Funnily enough, I learned out that learned out. I learned that in Spain, um, Kermit the Frog is called Rana Gustavo. Because Rana, reasons, uh, Rana de Gustavo. Rana Gustavo. It's, like, Rana it's basically Gustavo. Frog, Frog Gustavo, okay. or Gustavo the Frog. <laughs> okay. Um, nice. You can actually see that there, uh, uh, you, with your uh, light spell on you, you can see that there are three frogs. Yep. There. And I'm gonna bop this one. Okay, go ahead. I bop. That's... Oh, wait, sorry, that's with bless. Sorry, yeah, but uh, 17 is a hit, so don't worry. Yeah. Oh, that's, it's actually 19 because I've still got plus 2 from the thing. From yeah. um, dueling. Mm -hmm. uh, which I should add somewhere. Um, so, yep, so I whap him. And uh, I hit him for 7 slashing, I think. Or is it 9? No, it's 9 slashing, sorry. Nine I add the, yeah, I add the two from my um, dueling. You want to get dueling for uh, the damage, not the attack roll. Yeah, that's what I meant. I did, so I rolled a 17, but I hit for nine. Nine, okay. And I mark him using my class feature, which is unwavering mark. How do I... Oh. Can I just drag that to the chat? No. Okay, he's marked. Yep. Uh, so if he attacks anyone but me, I get to hit him. Okay, well, he's a toad, oh, so sorry. he's probably gonna... No, I... And he has disadvantage on anyone within five feet of me that he tries to... that is not me. So if he tries to attack anyone who's within five feet of me, he has disadvantage. Okay. Uh, okay, so sure thing. Uh, so anything else? Nope, that's it. Gail, you see a frog, giant frog. It's been taking a few hits. But it seems to be fine for now. 
Okay, I jump in there and I cast Bane. When you get around the corner, you spot another two uh, two additional frogs. I cast Bane on all three. They need to make charisma saves. Okay. Given none of them is the fent the fabulous Mr. Toad, I think uh, you're pretty safe. None of them are Gustavo. Fifteen. That's right. An eight. And a zero. <laughs> that first one is a hella charismatic frog. Yeah, so two of them fail. Yeah, he rolled a nineteen. So, any attack or saving throw, they have to roll a d4 and subtract it. So, the 15 is a fail too? No, the 15 is a pass. My okay. spell DC is a pitiful 13. Okay. So, whenever I target the uh, fails, this signal makes an attack roll or saving throw for the spell. My spell, and I think that's all I'm gonna do. Okay, so I'm they have to have... retract the d4, okay? Got it. That's my turn. I bring up my shield and get ready to get smacked. Uh, wait a minute. Did you roll twice or did you... First of all, did you roll twice? Two, three, four, five, six. Oh shit! I forgot to clear it the last time. Sorry, guys. Uh, I have to put everything in automatically. Can you guys roll initiatives again, please? I messed up. Better than my previous one. Yeah, and just uh, put in the previous uh, initiatives. Uh. Sixteen. Uh, I think seven. you need to click your token and then roll. There you go. Seventeen. Gail, you got what? No, I changed uh, it. A seven. Okay, so this is the right order, so... I'm gonna just go to uh, Gail right away. Sorry, Natalie. When I get to you, Natalie, you can make three, uh, two actions and one bonus action. What? Hmm? The the order got messed up uh, last time. I didn't end up going. Uh, no, this was the right order. And this, then, is, this is the right order. Yeah, yeah Gail, Gail went, and so it should be... Should be me now. Yeah, yeah it Darlene's should be there. Right. Okay, darn it. Yeah. But did you do anything, Natalie? I don't remember you did. Yeah. Anything. Yeah. yeah. Oh and yeah, you did spirit the weapon. Oh god, Jesus Christ. Yeah, oh. I did vicious uh, mockery and, and then spirit weapon. Oh yeah, okay. Derlin, your turn. Hey. Is a giant hyena considered a large creature? 
Yeah, it's it's it, it, it says it large. Should say, it should say either medium or large on the. Oh, right there. Yep. Uh, okay. Well, I guess I'll turn into um. Oh god, that's gonna just, switch me. Just Keep a wolf. I'll turn into just a wolf. Okay. <laughs> um, uh, Natalie, you've never actually seen me turn yet, have you? Uh... I don't think so. Yeah, it's kind of gruesome, to be honest. It's like snapping bones kind of deal. You should be able to I control the wolf, right? I pull out my yep, paper I and I start writing notes on it. Okay, <laughs> start writing notes. Yep. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm gonna run over here. Oh, the, yes, the shading doesn't you work. You definitely know what you're doing. You can, <laughs> you can stand underneath my book. The hammer. I can't quite see anything because my token's not on the map. Right, go one, one to your left. Okay, is there something there? Yeah, it, it's right. No, it's right below you. Okay. Uh, then I will do. I should have advantage on this because of pack tactic. Yep. Um. I don't know. Bite it. Nom. Ooh. Ooh. Does that hit? Uh, let's let's see. No, that will not hit. No. Oh. And since you're in darkness, you have disadvantage. Yeah, so you know. So a five natural one. I, no. Gale. Well, not Gale. Uh, Durlin doesn't have. Durlin has. Oh yeah, the Dark Mage light carries yeah. over. Also, yeah. also, Persevane has light on his shield, so uh, the light would be. Wait, let me fix the. Uh, fix that. I'm pretty sure I carry. I have either way. I have dark vision from and that carries over from. Wait. My. There, you should all see. Can you all see his light? Um, no. Now I can see. Okay. Good. Good, good, good. Okay. It's the toad's turns. If you is there anything else you want to do? You, you had bonus action, uh, okay, you had bonus action and action. So you did your stuff. Mhm. Mm now it's the toad's turns. And this toad He's gonna try and swallow Derlin. Uh, Derlin's wolf. Disadvantage. Yeah, 16 versus his AC. Uh, it has to be grappling it. Target is uh... In an order to swallow something, it has to be grappling the creature. Yeah, the target is grappled. Oh, that's what the bite is for. Yeah. Uh, it was it trying to eat? Okay. Yeah, it's trying to eat you, Derlin. Oh. It... Sorry. Did that one fail the bane? Oh, yeah. Or this one? Roll a d4. Oh, yeah, d4. Oh, yeah, that's right. Which one failed it, though? Yeah, or two of them failed? failed it. What? No, one failed. Two so a uh, twelve. Thought... Yeah, two failed. Yeah, two failed. Yeah. So this it's one failed. Hit. So it's a twelve. Does twelve does not hit me? Well, actually, hold on. The wolf might. No, I have thirteen armor class as a wolf. 
Okay. Uh, uh, this one succeeded the roll, just you know. I marked him with a green one. And this one is gonna take. I'm gonna go over here and try to swallow. Uh, Press vein. Uh, you didn't take any damage because uh, 12 didn't hit you. Oh, okay, sorry. Yeah, that one failed. This toad is gonna jump right over here, right above you. And uh, try to swallow Gale. Roll that d4. It's a disadvantage, a disadvantage, right? Because of... No. No. The only one that had disadvantage was the one person yeah. marked. Okay. Yeah, the, uh, yeah, the only one is the one I marked. And <laughs> yeah, so... Hopefully soon to be dead. So, an 18 versus your AC, Gale? No, that gets me. I am, I am the Swallowed. Uh, okay, so you take 3d6. Yeah. Nasty. Wait, 3d6? Holy shit. Yeah, those things are terrible if they actually do manage to get you and swallow you. It's terrible. Uh, yeah. Actually, no. Uh, the swallow target is blind and restrained. It has total cover against attacks and other effects outside, so, and it takes 3d6 acid damage at the start of each of the total's turn, so not until the next turn. Oh, okay. Uh, but you do take uh, da bite damage. Uh, why isn't showing the bite damage? God damn, why isn't it showing? Uh, okay. You take from the actual bite nine piercing damage plus one poison damage. And suddenly, two more toads show up. Another frog? Four? Two more toads showed up. Two, five? <laughs> yep. So, five, ten. Gustavo, no! <laughs> uh, this one can't reach, uh, but... This toad's gonna try and bite and swallow Gale. Already been swallowed. <laughs> Uh, no, Persevain, I mean, Persevain. And it's... A... Maybe they're fighting for you, and their tongues are down each other's throats. Okay, so that's a 20 hit you, Persevain. <laughs> Persevain? Does a 20 hit you? Yeah, yeah, it hits. Sorry, I'm... Not sure why you can't hear me. And you, know? you are swallowed. Dang, it. Hang on, wait a minute, wait a minute. What? I'm just checking something. <laughs> well, no, at least I you take... Make a, I don't have to make a deck save, do I? For what? Cursors. Oh, for that attack. And... Uh, no. There's no... Damn it. Deck save. So you take... 
Um, dude, I'm just reading that. The toad makes one bite attack against a medium or small target. It is grappling, which yeah. means it has to grapple me first. So it can grapple me, but that's a con that's a contested strength check. Uh, no, the bite grapples you automatically. Yeah. Bite. The target is grappled. Escape DC. Oh, okay. Oh, so so the bite. Yeah, the yeah. bite hits me, but I'm not swallowed. I'm grappled. Uh, so it's restrained and toad can't bite another target. Because I'm just yeah. I'm just reading it. So it has to be has to be biting me already, and then it has to make a grapple. It has to make a swallow attempt. It's like two separate attacks. So it makes one bite attack against me or smaller. If the attack hits, the target is swallowed. Mm, no, you're reading the wrong thing. So, bite. The attack is grappled. Yep. Escape DC 13. Until okay. the grapple ends. The target is restrained. And, and the toad can't bite another target. Fine, great. The toad makes one bite attack against a medium or smaller creature. It is grappling. Which means... That it can bite and grapple me, and then it can make a swallow attempt. Oh, okay. Uh, but you take seven piercing damage from the actual bite, and another five poison damage. So, okay, so Gale, you're not actually swallowed. Hey. So you, uh, um, but uh, on your turn you have to make an a your action to try and escape. If you're not, you're swallowed. Right. But we're restrained. That sucks. I'm yes. not. Well, you're, you're you're grappled, not restrained. The target is restrained. The target is restrained, and the toad can't bite on our target. That means attacks against us. So advantage. this one and uh, this one can't attack. But the other three can. And now it's the yellow's turn. Hello. I'm gonna peek around this corner and cast Firebolt because I'm panicking and grossed out. Yeah. <sighs> Uh, on this one that has the red mark on it. You actually prepared uh, you, you a firebolt. Uh, the, I, I the prepare would have ended after. Yeah. After her. Uh, after after next, next turn. Yeah, yeah, I actually. I, me, uh, I actually forgot to ask you why. You, uh, how are you gonna trigger it? So yeah, it ended. So roll firebolt. Uh, Eleven is a hit. Okay. Which and one do you hit? Which one are you attacking? The one with the red the dot. The one that's right? directly next to me with the red dot, because I don't want to hit my. Uh, you get disadvantage on the attack roll because you're within five feet. How do I do disadvantage? Uh, the lowest. It's the seven. It's the seven. What? Oh, it's okay. Yeah, you get disadvantage so when it comes to, to spell that. attacks. You get disadvantage when you're within uh, five feet. A creature because of they they can react okay if you want to so then i'm gonna move back and that's it mm, and since scale is restrained uh, this one uh yeah okay yeah this one uh this one's gonna try and uh, bite you Bite who? He's gonna bite you. This one. Me? Oh. Because you Before I on. move back? Yeah. Yeah, you moved into its oh. radius and then moved out of it, so it has an attack opportunity. Yeah, but this, oh, okay. uh, this one has disadvantage against attacks other than Persevain. Five? The 10 doesn't hit you, Athena. Yeah. I don't know. Ten. How would I see that? It's your on AC. your character sheet. Your, your AC. AC. Oh, okay. Nelly. Okay. So. 
Um, action! Eldritch Blast on this guy. 14 is a hit. 7 damage. Is this still up? Oh, yes. Bonus action! Spiritual weapon! <laughs> Same guy. <laughs> Ten is a miss. Damn. That's all I got. Plus six? Jeez. Wow. But I it's it's damage though. My it's, it, it is damage though. It's it's damage. You have wounded the toad, so. Preservain. Okay, so first thing I'm gonna try and do is I'm going to try to break the grapple. Uh, that is a strength check or a strength saving throw. Uh, it's a strength, strength, strength athletic. Yeah, strength athletic Athletics. of uh, uh, or uh, uh, acrobatics. Pretty sure twenty five breaks it. Yeah, and I'm not even gonna t contest that. <laughs> because, yeah, right. it's a DC thirteen. Right. So, so you're free of the grapple. Now the, the this one here. Is, no, I can't do anything else because that was my action. Yeah, that was your action. Um, the other one behind uh, you is uh, holding Gale. That guy, yeah, right, cool. So Whipperforth is going to move to here. To move to this area. And cast Burning Hands. Oh, cool. Nice. Which is, should get everything in... How is he aiming it? It's how? a cone. Yeah, yeah, but how is he aiming the cone? Because it's one, so it and then two, and like then three. This way? And, no, no, no. And this way. So, uh, the thing it's with the cone, cone is that it goes one, and then it goes two. You have to pick either this one or this one, and then go three, what? like this, or three like this. That's the cone. That's not a cone, though. Yeah, that's it. A, that's a Pythagorean. That's a right angle triangle. Um, uh, no, it's, it's, it, like, it's centered not off of the cone as like a triangle. No, yeah, it, it goes like me. this. It'd be off, it goes. It'd be yeah, off Perseverance. Not Perseverance. Whip, no, it'd be off Whipperforth. Yep. Whipperforth cast it, not me. Yeah, yeah but it, it goes like where me. it starts five feet up in front of him, and then it and then it expands ten feet, and then it expands fifteen feet. So yeah. So it should be 10. Oh wait, five feet in front of me. Hang on, so 10. So I get those two. And then... Uh, uh, it starts 15, here. Right? It, it doesn't start on him. It starts here. This square. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so it should hit those two. The edges of it should. Uh, it should hit either these two. Uh, the, it can actually hit all three, but you can't hit this one. Oh, right, so I can Oh, I see what you're saying. Okay. So I'd hit... Yeah, I'd hit uh, these three. Yeah. The three up here. Yeah, you hit... Uh, you hit, can hit this three and, and without to get... Uh, without letting yeah, without uh, either you or uh, Derlin get hit. The, the yeah. third cone... The uh, third part of the cone just goes right into the wall here. Cool. Yep, so uh, that is... Let me just roll for that one. It's 3d6, that I think? Is, yep, the 3d6. 13. And it's... Uh, uh, Dexter, the same throw. Yeah, Dex. Man, so, this... Um, so the first one... Impressive. Well, no. uh, the first one, this one took a lot of damage, and he's so incredibly wounded, but he's not dead. He needs to die. Uh -huh. Oh, that's cool. Thanks for that, Casey. No problem. 
Okay, so what's the, uh, the sa spell save for his uh, burning hands? Uh, the, let me check. Be I think dex. It's it's, it is dex, but I'm just trying to check the spell uh, save for him. He should have a spell, spell to see, save is. He has, it, has, it, has it here somewhere. I think it's like 12 or 13. Give me a second. I would say for the sake of argument, I haven't it's actually 13. had to look at this. Uh, I would say for now it's 13. It can change higher. So the other two. Uh, these two, they succeed. So they take only half damage. Curses. <laughs> Still, that's like what? Uh, six, that's seven damage? Six, six damage. Yeah. Okay. Uh, anything else? Uh, anything else uh, we prefer it's doing? Um, he is then going to. So hang on, I just need to see how much of his movement does he have actually any, used. Does he have any bonus actions? Then, no, he doesn't. Okay. Uh, so he's used ten. So he's got forty. So he's going to then fly. Fly away. Back up these steps. <laughs> uh, uh, away. He's actually down. Which he he's can actually do. down the stairs. Fly away. Uh, that, then he flies yeah. down the stairs <laughs> and away. Okay, he is actually 10 feet out of their reach, so. Good. That's That was his plan. Gale. Break free from the grapple. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> you think you do. Yeah, you think, but no. All you right, are I grappled and... College try. And actually, you should be small. Uh, I probably will be when he bites it, me it yeah. yeah, I was going to say, at the beginning of the frog's turn. Yeah. Well, let's... That, that's your action, and you have any bonus actions? I can ask Cry. <laughs> <laughs> Do we have two of those now? Oh I cast my god, it. please. I cast it here. Wait, where? Here, and I smack the frog that's been taking damage. Okay. And it comes out looking like a scimitar. <laughs> or a hammer. Either or. Two hammers. Uh, controlled by Gale. So, so one is controlled by Gale and one is controlled by Natalie. Nice. Does an 11 hit? Yes. Then it takes 7 damage. Uh, this one is dead. Did we manage to murder one? This one is dead. He had one HP nice. left, and you're still master of the one, two hit point left kind of thing. Yep. Oh my god. That's what happened last time in this damn, this damn little cave. All right, uh, that's my no, turn. No, it happened like every other kind of encounters in Stonking's Thunder. Did it? Yeah, probably. All right, that's my turn. I am ready to face my Darling. my acid. You're in the same space as the flying hammer that's flying above your head. Great. <laughs> uh, can I get over here? Or can I invade this yeah, space right can, here to get closer? You can actually, you could jump up on the toad. Remember, it's a large toad. And it's oh, going to yeah. be slippery. Uh, and remember, uh, toads are probably slippery. Damn it. Uh... So you're gonna waste about, I would say, ten feet of movements to jump up on that one. Oh, that's fine. That's that's all good. Actually, no. Uh, actually, no. Fifteen, because you slip. Uh, your paw. Uh, you, you don't get a good grip on the body. I have forty feet of movement. I'm not worried about it. I'm just going for the next turn. Yeah. Oh, man. Uh, 
bite this one that's in front of me here. This one. Okay. Go ahead and make and it. And I have advantage because of pack tactics. Yes, you do. Twenty-one. Ha. And that hits. Uh, why is it not rolling? What option to? Roll? Damn it. It's too. Four. I didn't roll. I. <laughs> I need two of these. <laughs> Three, five damage. In all. Yeah, I'm gonna fix that later on. 2d4s? Yeah, I just rolled 2d4s. Uh, yeah. And it's plus two, so. Uh, so that's five. Yes. And it has to roll above an 11 or be knocked prone. Can you even knock uh, knock prone a large someone that's larger than you? Jesus. Uh, uh doesn't say I can't. I can. Strength. Mm, some some classes can. Like there are some that are just like you can knock this prone and it doesn't even give a size. Like uh, I think. Uh, <laughs> Runs up to giant. <laughs> the feet. Tiny wolf. <laughs> yeah, technically, like I think the feet, like shield master or whatever. It's like if you have a bonus action and you attack them and the attack hit, you can use your bonus action to like knock them prone, and it doesn't give a size. So <laughs> technically, you could just knock a dragon over. <laughs> Hits angle. Mm, oh no! Yeah. Falls. Okay, so yes, your <laughs> uh, the toad is not prone, but yeah, it's actually sitting down. So I'm not sure how you knock this <laughs> frog prone. I went for the ankles. He oh. tripped it. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, and the I bonus pulled actions? a cat and went between his legs. And the bonus um, action. Can I do anything? I don't have any bonus, so no. Okay. <laughs> the Toad's turn. Uh, okay. Gale, this Toad is going to try and swallow you now. So, da 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 Target is grappling, if the attack hits the target, oh yeah, he has to try and bite you. Yeah, he crits me. Does he have advantage? Yeah, because he's grappled. I'm, re I'm restrained. I'm restrained. Oh. Yeah. Okay, so you take the damage and you are swallowed. What are you at? <laughs> I'm at 23. About to be oh. one uh, okay, so you take seven from the bite plus, plus another four poison. So eleven damage and you're swallowed. So I take twenty two damage. Total, yes. If from the last attack, yes. So oh my god. <laughs> Guess it's a one hit point, guys. It's me. No oh, gosh. If you go down, I'll get you up. Don't worry. Hey, wait. Hey, I... You took only 11 Fortunately, damage now. Fortunately, you now have full cover. You I only... took 22 because it's it's a crit, isn't it? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I forgot about that. So yeah. Yeah. So let's oh. see. Okay. Well, my, well, my bad. Big okay. There goes, well, okay. There goes Since... Bane. Well. Okay. Okay, here, my bad. Uh, I missed the crit, so you take only 11. I'm gonna be nice to you now and uh, let you take only the 11, not 22, because I missed the crit. I'll take, I'll no? take the 22. No, I, I, already, I missed it. <laughs> I missed it. I already it's... marked it down. <laughs> <laughs> I already marked it down. I'm at one hit point. Well, that's fine. I don't mind. Me is for the dying and healing word. That's about um, it. Okay. <laughs> This two is gonna go jump over here. No, oh, actually, it's gonna yeah go. So you are in this space. So this space is now free. 
Uh, this frog is gonna try and uh, bite and grapple you, Persevane. He's welcome to try. Nope. Yeah, no. This frog is gonna try and uh, swallow the wolf. And he's gonna bite. And gra he's gonna. He's gonna try and grapple you first, and then see if he can swallow you. Does a fourteen hit you, AC? Um. Yes. Okay. So you take. I uh, take four poison. No, yeah, okay. no, no, four piercing and eight poison. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm out of wolf form. <laughs> yeah, and you take uh, one oh, damage rip. to your normal form. Oh my god. <laughs> Do you have any more? Uh... Oh yeah, I have, I, wild, wild I have shape. plenty of wild shape. I have two more uses. This one is actually gonna jump. It's gonna take a twenty feet jump, ten feet high, jump past all you. So oh, my grapple. Yeah, your grapple. Shit. Uh, Persevane, you're not grappled, so you can uh, try and make. Uh, you have an attack of opportunity. I'm certainly gonna try and make an attack of opportunity on that dude. He's gonna jump oh, all the, the way up here. character sheet. He's gonna, he's gonna fucking uh, hey. try. But it's hey, like girl, a goddamn hey. sentinel. Hey. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'ma hit him. Okay. I don't hit him. Oh. No. Oh. Okay. But a water. Diala. Did you have advantage on that attack? I did not. Oh. Diala. He's gonna try and grapple you with a bite. Okay. Does a 12, 12 hit your AC? Does a 12 hit your AC? No. Oh. Good. Ha! Eat it! <laughs> He's <laughs> trying! <laughs> your turn! Okay, do, um, what do we wanna... gonna be done today? Yeah, I was gonna say, do we wanna stop here? Cause it's... Yes, we can actually stop here. It's at the top it, of it's the order. A, it's the top of the order, yeah. and it's past nine, so I have to go to bed. I have to be up in about seven hours. So, yeah. Ew. Oh, yeah. That's why it's only a two-hour game today. Alright, hang on. I'm just going to quickly log out of this, and I'm going to go home, and I'm going to try and send you all invites. Oh, okay. for the... For the other one. Ooh. For the what? So, what? For the one we're going to... For those of us who are here next week, I've got a little one-shot. So, it's going to be... Just a, a nice oh, little... Yeah. Um, short. Short. Yeah. <gasps> oh, cool. right. Short I forgot stream. to tell you guys. I will not be here next week. I will be at the beach. You yeah. told... Um... Yeah. Show them. yeah, we know. That's so why, yeah, uh, that, that's why that yeah, frog, Ash Natalie. is uh, go doing his own uh, one shot thing. Yeah. Uh, yeah. With, with the original yeah, like, oh. with the original team, so that's right. Well, just you know, with anyone who wants to take yeah. part. Yeah. But, um, and all yeah. of you who wants to take part. If any of you... it gets when it gets a little closer to the date, I can now tell that you why. Should... Yeah. If I can be, yeah. I, I don't think I will, but. Yeah, you can send a message to. Uh, we're gonna use this uh, Discord, so. Okay, catch you later, bye. Catch bye. you later, Everybody. have fun, bye. bye. Cool, so that worked. Yeah. Awesome. So, uh, short session All today. Right, I'll and... talk to you guys later then. But it catch was later. fun. Bye. bye. Yeah, catch you later, bye. bye. I hope you enjoyed it. And next week, uh, one of my players. Persevane is gonna make, do his own. Uh, he's gonna do his own one-shot thing. So it's gonna be interesting. I have no idea what I'm gonna be playing because I'm gonna roll the race and also gonna roll the class. So 
who knows what that combination could be. I'm very excited about it. Uh, never done it before, so it's gonna be fun. But anyway, I'm gonna be streaming it, so I hope you guys are watching. And uh, please press the follow button. And I hope you enjoy my streams. Bye.